As you drive to the end of Carruthers Parkway in Cool Springs near Nashville, you can finally see the new Nissan building beginning to take shape. More than 3,400 tons of structural steel will go into the building. And what you see behind me, that's the first phase of steel going up, and that's the north side of the building. You know, I think it's time now for the employees to really get excited. We're trying to step up the communications to them now all the way through December. And then, believe it or not, we're going to have to start talking about moving. So exciting times ahead. Basically, we're on the west side of the building, which will be the back of the building. Um, what you see now is these the concrete structures that are up we call shear walls and that contains your stairwells and your elevators to get you up through the building for the employees and the executives. The two you see here, the one that's complete and the one that's uh, being poured today are the actual main elevator banks that the employees will use to get to each of the floors. Between those two um, shear walls is where your main lobby will be and there's like a three-story atrium that goes in there. If you're looking where the, all these trucks and equipment sit, that's the basement level of the building where there will actually be a car salon, parking garage. Where you see the concrete wall in the background, the top of that wall is actually the first floor of the building where people will come in to the main entrance and access, um, whether it be your cafeteria, vendor, meeting places. Um, that's also the floor, the first floor is what houses your kitchen area, your cafeteria dining area. Um, and some of your meeting spaces. The site itself offers Nissan the opportunity to showcase the company's pro-environmental policies with acreage set aside as wetlands. There will also be a natural amphitheater on site which can be used for employee events and to showcase vehicles. We want it to be a very pleasant environment. The building is going to be light filled. Uh, there are going to be panoramic views of the countryside all around. We've, we've I think gone out of our way uh, not just to limit our footprint on the site, but really to improve the site and provide site amenities uh, that are going to be uh, really pleasant to be in and to see from inside the building. The building from the very beginning we benchmarked other companies and and uh, the, the way people work is really starting to change. You know, you find if you do uh, studies in this that some of them are out of their cubicles up to 60 percent of the time. So this building is really designed to have a free flow, informal meeting spaces, lots of conference areas. Um, the employees are going to find it very enjoyable, very light, very bright place to work. The $100 million facility is expected to be completed by mid-2008. The new building will be called Nissan Americas, and it's from here that the management committee will oversee and lead operations in North, South, and Central America. For NCOM in Franklin, I'm Suzanne K. Pittman.